Welcome back to our how to create add-ons in Adobe Express series. My name is Hamza and I'm a developer advocate on the Adobe Express team. In this video, we'll walk you through setting up your developer environment and creating your first add-on in Adobe Express. Are you excited? Let's get started. Before we dive in, you'll need to have the following installed. Node.js version 16 or higher and NPM version 8 or higher. You'll also need to have some familiarity with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript programming. To begin building add-ons for Adobe Express, you'll need an Adobe Express account. You can either use an existing Adobe ID or create a new one for free. If you have any questions about how to create an account, please check out our developer documentation. We'll be using the Adobe Express Add-on CLI, which just stands for Command Line Interface for Add-on Development. If you have any questions about accessing the CLI, again, please check out our developer documentation. Got everything you need? Let's create your first add-on project. Open the terminal and run the following commands. This command will create a new add-on named Hello World. It's gonna ask us to select a template from the list, including JavaScript, TypeScript, React JavaScript, and React TypeScript. You can choose whichever one you want, but for this, I'll just keep it very simple and go with JavaScript. Now that we have our project set up, let's open the directory using CD Hello World, then build the package using npm run build. And then once that's done, start the add-on using npm run start. This start script will display messages indicating that the add-on can now be sideloaded. To sideload your add-on, you can do this by enabling the developer mode from the add-ons panel in Adobe Express. Let me show you how to do that. In Adobe Express, click on your user avatar on the top right-hand corner and select settings. Toggle the add-on development option to enable the development and distribution tools for add-ons. Next, let's load and run your add-on in Adobe Express. Simply create a new project, click on the add-ons icon in the left rail and toggle on the add-on testing button. In the modal that appears, provide the URL of your locally hosted add-on. You can find the URL in your terminal. Fantastic, your add-on is up and running. Now let's make a quick change so we can add some customization. While your add-on is still loaded, open the index.html file in your code editor. From there, update the hello world body string to something like uh, my amazing add-on. Do you notice how the CLI's heart module reload feature automatically rebuilds your add-on in the terminal? Switch back to your browser with Adobe Express and you'll see the updated changes to your add-on without needing to refresh the page. Your add-on can continue to be updated and rebuilt automatically while it's running. Isn't that convenient? Congratulations, you've completed the developer environment setup and successfully run your first add-on. In the upcoming videos, we'll explore more in-depth topics like adding features, designing, debugging, and distributing your add-ons. Thank you for watching and happy encoding.